The Open Thesis Fabrication is a program that explores how we can translate research done in EAC towards something closer to the market. We are looking at collaboration with industry and trying to fabricate prototypes to scale one to one, the closest possible to the actual needs of architectures and what can architect contribute to the city. This is the core of this program where we address architectural question about our habitats. Open Thesis Fabrication is an interesting project because it's a, just a six-month research with a selected group of people who are designing and building. So you really get the experience of not just designing the project and doing the research behind it, but also getting your hands dirty and building what the project is all about. More and more industries picked about this Industry 4.0, where robotic fabrication, additive manufacturing, and new technology in digital tools will help to get better results, better finish, more complex shapes, but also lower down the price and maybe introduce better materials. Suddenly we understand that these machines are all about making, they're all about creating and they let us invent all sorts of new ways of making and also therefore ways of designing. We try to understand how with the technology that we have available today, with methods that we have available today, we can speculate on how to continue to get our habitat to evolve. OTF have been in the past a really nice platform to develop projects such as mini builders or the Fusta Robotica, Pylos. There have been many projects that succeed to convince quite a large audience in industry. Mini builders have been quite an exceptional one where in six months students have been able to develop their own custom made robots. Fusta Robotica was a project developed in uh, TF where the robotic fabrication of wood was explored. In this project, students have been developing a design, managing the shapes and the detail of construction to be both structurally optimized but also resistance to wind and catching really well the sun for the plants growing inside. Recently we have been doing a project constructing on top of the Pylos projects uh, where Earth was used as building materials. The seven of us have designed and done all the research for a 3D printing clay project which is actually a performative architecture piece for an entire building. Clay architecture exists all over the world and has all over history. Uh, what we do is we really optimize this material with some proteins and chemicals to allow it to be 3D printable and even stronger in performance. Now we are in the fabrication phase where we are fabricating about 50 blocks to build a wall that would speak the same language of the whole research through. We have this catalogue of different aspects of this brick or this uh, block and how can these robots start to produce and manufacture and start building. I think what makes IAC a really special place is the open creative space. You have a freedom to do whatever project you propose or whatever you want to come up with. It's just an open facility to create and to build innovative ideas with people who are there to support you to do so.